So I just arrived at the hangar at Blackpool and the plan today is to finally take the PA28 into Huddersfield which I must say I'm really excited about. I have been in there before in the Cessna 152 which went really really well. The PA28 is slightly larger and doesn't have the performance that the Cessna 152 has the short field capability. Approach Golf, Bravo November, Oscar Baffer at the pump with Lima, 1029, request taxi. Bravo November, Oscar Baffer, Blackpool Approach, Lima is currently 2980, correct. Taxi holding point, Alpha 3 for 10, via Alpha, correct 13. Taxi hold Alpha for runway 10, via Alpha, cross 13, 1029, Golf, Oscar Baffer. Bravo November, Oscar Baffer, Blackpool Approach, Lima is currently 2980, correct. Taxi holding point, Alpha 3 for 10, via Alpha, cross 13, 1029, Golf, Oscar Baffer. Bravo November, Oscar Baffer, Blackpool Approach, Lima is currently 2 What's, what's a run and three? Oh, You'll see now. There they go. Or here they come, I should say. All three. Right, movement. We're definitely like that. There's the car now. Go across the to Alpha 3 mid departure, like a southbound departure. South Oscar Papa, Rogers Cork 3650, after departure, the right turn out to route via St. Anne's Pier and Southport Pier, up above 1,500 feet. Cork 3650, after departure, it's right turn, routing Pier Spain, at altitude 1,500 feet, Gulf Oscar Papa. South Oscar Papa, correct, line up runway 10. Line up runway 10, Gulf Oscar Papa. Okay, approach clear. Approach clear. Got to take two runways to get. Gulf Oscar Papa, Rogers Cork 3650, clear to take off, surface degrees, 7 knots. Runway 10, clear takeoff, Golf Oscar Papa. Golf Alpha Kilo, taxi to the point, Alpha 3, via okay, taxiway Alpha, right side. runway 13. Golf Alpha Kilo, taxiway Alpha 3, 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 Golf Identified traffic service reduced to raise suppression. Check your altitude passing on the QNH1028. Traffic service passing altitude 1200 feet, climbing altitude 3000 feet 1028. Golf Oscar Papa. Golf Oscar Papa, Roger, report ready to leave the frequency and just arrange your flight to uh, avoid Romeo 312 restricted airspace to the northeast of Wharton. We'll go, uh, Golf Oscar Papa. Golf Oscar Fox, you QNH now of 1028. 1028, QNH, Golf Oscar Fox. Water radar, low up to zero three with you. Uh, Flyway one hundred, route in turn up. Uh, we have a twelve fifty back up base one zero two eight. Thanks zero three, Wharton radar. Good afternoon. The twelve fifty is current runway three five on set the QNH one zero two eight. Descent to altitude two thousand three hundred feet. Two thousand three hundred feet. 
Then an altitude 2,300 feet on the QNH uh, 1028 Vickers uh, 03. Couple of swappers leveling altitude 2,800 feet remain Victor Mike. Ask that for Roger. So I'm pleased that we're finally on the way to Huddersfield, definitely. I've, I've been before, have you, you've been before with me in the 152, haven't you, Wayne? Yeah. You've never been, Jack. I don't, I don't know, I don't think so. And then I've wanted to go in the PA28 for how long have we been trying to do it for? Six months, something like that? Wow, well, yeah. It's a, it's a, a great place. Uh, obviously, the interesting thing with it is um, we need to get ourselves into the overhead, just have a look at what the wind stop's doing. So we've got an easterly wind today which favours the downhill runway for landing, so that's going to be nice because we'll land into a headwind, but obviously we're going to be... Good afternoon, traffic's down at 12 o'clock, uh, descended altitude 3,200 feet on North London. Traffic sighted, go off, Oscar Papa. Where is it then? 11 o'clock. No factor. This yeah. is what's good about asking for a traffic service, because you see aircraft that you wouldn't all, all normally see, so we'd have only just seen him about now, but, you know, Adjunct Troll gave us a warning in before, that there was an aircraft there going northbound. And he's obviously not talking to one. No. But they've got him on... On radar, yeah. So we'll get ourselves to the overhead, just have a look at the wind stops doing, because if it's quite a strong wind, then we probably are better landing downhill with the headwind. Um, the benefit, if it was a really light wind or a crosswind, we'd land uphill, because obviously we're going to slow down quicker, our land distance is going to be shorter um, as soon as we touch down. We'll have a look. Also, the other benefit of landing on 2.5 is the fact that the starter runway is actually concrete, where it's grass on uh, zero 07, so at the minute it's sort of 50-50. I rang the guy and he said the wind's quite strong, and I've worked out the performance calculations of both runways, so I've worked out landing distance for runway 2.5 and runway zero 07, then also takeoff distances for runway 2.5 and runway zero 07. But today, with the wind, it is, is favouring taking off on zero 07, like hands down. So let's change the tank, it's pressure's holding, go to the right tank. Go for Oscar Papa, Scope 7000, now radar service, uh, terminate, free call, leads are 134, decimal 575. Scope 7000, leads 134, 575, see you later, Scope Papa. Leads radar, good afternoon, Golf, Bravo, November, Oscar Papa, request basic service. Bravo, November, Oscar Papa, leads radar, good afternoon to you, pass the Golf Bravo, and Moscow Bravo, PA28, Blackpool to Huddersfield, we're going just 8 miles southwest of Pole Hill, 2,800 feet, 1,028. Thanks for that, sir. Thanks. Uh, lead to QNH 1027, remain outside, lead to control air space, ever base, six service, own navigation. Radio service 1027, remain outside, Golf Oscar Bravo. So they just basically gave us a basic service of just information on weather, important things that happen in the area, really, no traffic okay, information. Radar control. Um, we could have asked for a traffic service. But we're only about seven, eight minutes away now, so by the time we've got radar identified, we're going to be changing frequency pretty quickly. Copy, 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 and 120.3, Golf, over Baba. They've got North East 5 knots. Yeah. On the ground, so they are similar, won't they? Golf, I suppose I'd like to things change to Huddersfield, 128.375. What's the path, sorry, going to Huddersfield? Hey, sir. Okay, carry on route. Bye bye. On route, good day, Gosh. What does she say on route? Just said change your on route frequency. Oh, change on route, I missed that word. Okay, 128375. Huddersfield Radio Golf Bravo November Oscar Papa, 8 miles to the west inbound. So now we just make blind calls, there's no one there. I've got 5 minutes to run. So we've got to keep really good eyes out now, we'll put the landing lights on a bit early, luckily we can do that because um, they're an LED, so we're not going to burn them out or anything. It's quite hard to spot this old Huddersfield, so we're currently at 2,800 feet, which puts us basically in their overhead, so we're going to be 1,000 feet above whatever circuit traffic is there. There might be some non-radio circuit traffic as well, so, so we'll do pre-landing checks just quite early now. So. Toes are clear, the brakes and parking brakes are under tarriage, attached on next. Mystery is fully rich, pupil pumps coming on. Instruments, we don't know the QFE yet, but uh, well, we're, if we get the height, we can sort of make it of ourselves, but we'll be okay. Um, 
All lights are on, you're all strapped in and locked, you're all strapped in and locked, no yeah. crazy loose objects. No. We uh, just lost eyes on it, but it's just down to our left, it just jinked us off slightly. We yeah, are visual. Yeah, so I've got the wind soft and it's definitely favouring 07. Got the wind sock. Yeah, I've got it. Clutchfield Radio Golf, Oscar Papa, one mile to the west, joining in the overhead. Zero, zero 07, is the uphill. Zero 07 is downhill. Oh, downhill. Have you changed your mind then? I'm just having a look, I just want to get in the, uh, get yeah. in the overhead and just have a proper look, really. Yeah, I can see the quarry now on the runway. It's a long runway. Yeah. I mean, it's straight down zero 07. Going off that. And is the runway the first bit of grass? Yeah, zero 07. Oh, it's well long enough then. Yeah, I think we'll select zero 07 going off that wind. Because the wind yeah. is looking stronger than I initially, well, it was only meant to be three or four knots. Stronger than that, looking at that wind sock. Yeah, so in the overhead now, it's, I can't see any traffic joining. Got Oscar Roberts in the overhead for runway 07. Yeah, it's straight down 07, isn't it? Yes. And it's well long enough. Yeah, I can't see any uh, any other traffic down on the airfield moving around. I think we'll cut off Oscar Papa is descending dead side for runway 07 left hand. So we'll just cut the power. We need to get into 1,800 feet. We'll just go in the overhead. Well, sorry, not the overhead. We're just going to go into uh, upwind. Just join the circuit crosswind. Yeah, it's straight down zero 07, isn't it, the wind? Yeah, it's sweet, that runway. I'm well long enough then. No one joining downwind? Corpus Crap is joining the circuit left crosswind runway zero 07. Yeah, I can't see anyone in the circuit or anyone joining. You don't want to go too wide here, in case you have an engine failure at all, do you? Corpus Papa, downwind runway 07, left hand to land. OK, pre-landing is done, toes are clear, all set. OK, approach to 07 is looking clear, can't see any traffic coming in. And there's no one sort of on a wider circuit than us, left base or anything. I reckon you'll be stopped by the end of the grass. I, yeah, I don't think you're going to be wrong at that, to be honest, mate. Okay, final approach is looking clear. Corpus Papa's left base from way 07 to land. We're a bit high at the minute, but I want to be high in case the engine goes pop because we've not got too many options. But approach is looking clear. Two stages of flaps in, looking for 70 knots. There's final, still a bit high. Cops probably final zero seven to land. Get the final stage of flaps in. Our people's keep on a second. Still high, correcting nicely. Okay, car beat away. At 65, still a little bit high. There we 
Windshaker. They have a windshaker gust there, wasn't there? And it's easing on the brakes. Yeah, so I didn't want to smash it into the grass. <laughs> oh. uh, I mean, uh, we, to be fair, it's a, a bit of a strange perception, that really. I was a bit higher than I thought. Uh, but I mean, we landed okay. You can see the, you can see the hill now. <laughs> Go on, Oscar Papa's Vega, uh, backtracking runway 07. Yeah, that was the right choice, wasn't it, with that wind? Because that wind stops almost level. That is definitely the right choice, and it was well done considering. Never done it before. Uphill, downhill, <laughs> grass. <laughs> you couldn't get more mix, could you? Oh, it's brilliant. That's what I like about this place. Okay, so really, we did still stop in quite a short distance. If you know, if you look at it, I mean, that is a short... Yeah, the wind stops almost well, isn't it? I reckon we've got about 8 to 10 knots of wind up here, you know. I thought the grass bit was up here. Yeah. Oh, is it? It's flat. Go for Oscar Papa's vacator on my 07. Welcome to Huddersfield International. Oh, so this grass looks quite firm, doesn't it? I think we'll be okay going on it, do you think? That's yeah, alright. We're not making a big rut behind us, are we? Uh, not so bad. Well, okay, I'm having set 1200. NCPs are all on the green. Well, okay. Radio's off. Just got down in the PA28 at Huddersfield, which was really good. I've been wanting to come here for absolutely ages. Um, we decided to land and go for runway 07, which does have a downhill, which is over there. We'll show you the downhill in a second. Um, but it worked out better just due to the wind, really. The wind at the moment is uh, literally straight down 07. So that was definitely the best thing to do. We're just going to have a look now at just the condition of the, the grass and the runway and see how soft it is. Um, for our departure, we're best taking off downhill, so the threshold's just over here. And the coolest thing about Huddersfield is, this, it's literally, it's a private sort of airfield, um, and there's nothing here really. It's just a really nice place. It's on the top of the hills up near Huddersfield, um, on the moors, and the weather today is brilliant. Dangerous, isn't it? It's cool. I like it here. I like visiting airfields like this because they're just a bit different than like Blackpool, where I learned to fly, which is really, really big, obviously. When they go in here, Wayne. <laughs> just filling in the uh, departure board. This is obviously where it's got all the flight times on. And it's literally just a caravan in here. It's so cool. Just as airfields go, it's really random, but it's like border force, don't anyone flying uh, illegal things in. Yeah. 